Alright, um, basically the underground is around the corner where artists, upcoming artists and rappers look for a platform to showcase their talent. We discovered that um, in, the, in the music industry, the niche and there's a space for upcoming artists to show their talent and it was really not available. Most talent had to struggle or case I had to make a couple places just so that they can get their music out there. So we came together as a team to establish the platform where people can come and show up their talent. I wanted to make it more um, interactive so we decided to get a very good crowd that have a um, good ear for music and they can actually listen to this music. So they, they determine who the best is and then we try to just put it together. Whoever wins the, the underground anyway, um, we push them out in terms of get them prizes, record deals, um, you know, pop, a lot of publicity, make people know them and make them know and stuff like that. So basically, that's what the underground is. Um, the vision of the underground is um, basically like just how it started. It's just, it's all about music. Right, um, yeah. it's, <laughs> it's basically about music. And the way it started is um, we. We, a lot of people came to me and they're like, oh, they're good people, they can actually sing, they can actually do this and do that, but they don't know how to do it, who to go and meet and everything. So we decided that it's for us about the music and it's about getting good music out there. You know, there's a lot of good music and there's a lot of not so good music out there. So we're just like the bottom line to help see the type of music that comes into the industry. So basically that's what we're doing. Oh. Uh, members of Inner Circle, whoever. Well, uh, how many? Oh, five. Well, five. Shy is president. I handle PR. Uh, we have the technical aspect of it Nikki, Shane, and Tega. And then we have some members who are abroad. Uh, with me and uh, okay. So uh, we're all friends. We all went to the same university, except Tega, who we met like a person. And we all have the same idea. Uh, Shane is also into music. He sings. And also went to the radio station. Um, we've had three editions. Um, the first one was in May. We had the second one in August. And then we had the third one two weeks ago, November 27th. Um, the first edition was won by Sheon, Sheon Oni. The um, second one was by Olumbe Hari, Paul Kama, and then third one by Will Smith. Uh, we tried not to push them out. And we have like an element of Bella Niger, she puts them on. We did launch a page, so 360 months as well. Um, and other uh, websites, electronic websites are also looking, electronic media websites are also looking to feature our people and it's costing them loads of publicity. You know, some of the upcoming artists, the runners of have had privileges of working with people like uh, Ike Chuku, LD, and Wandi. So that's about that. Yeah, and also I just want to say that when basically the underground has grown from like when Kyle was talking about the editions, yeah. we were, we were like the first edition was about 80. About 80. And then 80. and then the last edition we had grown to about 400. And uh, which which is which which actually shows that uh, the platform is well well embraced by people and yeah. by the public and we're very grateful for that. We are really very grateful. It was just an idea and paper before and then now it's something out there. So we're grateful about that. But what is stands to gain? Contestants, um, as you guys will still talk to them and it's done a lot for them. They were never they were not known. Another came, uh, opportunity for them to just you know, just have fun, get their music out there and fine enough. People are demanding for their songs, uh, so I had to put together like a sort of mixtape of the songs and like distribute and stuff. So they start to gain a lot of publicity, uh, increase, which is really what it's about for them. Um, okay, um, in ten years on the ground, it should have blown up. <laughs> because we're just. Because we have, we have, um, we've done just three editions now, and we have such a very huge crowd. And then the entries, like the last time we had 50 entries, we had to be cut down to 15. So it, it had, as in the, if we have by 10 years, I think it'll be a known platform for upcoming artists. You know, they're like, want to go into music, I think you should contact them at Underground. You know, because basically that's what we do. It's, it's all about the music for us. And so in 10 years' time, we see us, ourselves doing the same thing, maybe on a bigger stage, larger better. crowd, better. And taking into consideration more stuff, but basically, we see ourselves going all that way. Um, well, the criteria to 
paint. It's very easy if you, you you can sing, you can rap, you have the demo CD, yeah. and you're ready to go into the industry. And you should just come talk to us, and you're serious about it because we know a couple of people that are not just serious about it. But if you're, if you're ready and you have a demo CD, you're ready to go into. It, you come and meet us. Basically, we take your CDs, you buy a form, you um, get registered, and then we gather all the CDs together. We have um, a panel of musicians and professionals that actually listen to the music and show us to pick the best 15 guys. And, and, uh, and then also, like, if they if they don't know any of us and they're trying to contact us, you can send an email to v under g at live.co.uk. That's T H E under then g at live.co.uk and one of the team members will respond and call them to talk about as well. Or one tweet as well. It's just say um at the under so under g so and we will always follow back as well. Alright, so um, I just want to say a big thank you to 360 Nubs for giving us the opportunity to actually um, talk about the underground. Thank you for, to everybody that has actually contested. Thank you to all the members, to all the sponsors, to people, our loyal crowd that are always there all the time to attend. We're very grateful and we see ourselves on top. Thank you very much. Okay, and um, we also want to thank Chocolate City. <laughs> yes, um, just Jack was at the last edition, and um, he he was amazing. And um, the last winner, the, the last the winner is last Oye Smith. She's gonna be recording with him her first solo, so we're really really grateful. And he's using that medium for him to give back, and we're we're grateful that he decided to pick us as a medium to give back. Yeah, thank you.